Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing well. So today I'm back with another What I Eat In A Day. This time I'm gonna be, last time I did it, basically I wasn't like counting my macros and calories, but this time I am gonna be because I'm really trying to get like back on track with my healthy eating. Fitness and like healthy eating. I don't wanna say like it's a big part of my life, but like I go to the gym four times, four times a week now. I used to do five and I do mainly eat healthy especially like during the week the only time i really will give myself a tr little well a treat as such like a cheat meal or something is on the weekend and i feel like i just want to incorporate this more into my channel obviously everyone needs to eat different amounts i use a website called is it iifym or something like that i'll link it in the description box anyway i ask you a ton of questions like your weight your height like your activity level what you do as a job that kind of stuff basically it just comes up with a like suggested gives you a breakdown of your macros your carbs fats and your protein and your calories so then i then put it, use that and input it on my fitness pal which i use to like track all my calories and macros yeah make sure to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and yeah let's get on with the video so all i'm doing oh my god i can't open this pour in about 50 grams of oats there we go dead on and then i'm going to pour in a little bit of out pro oh i just do this by my eye basically but i mean like 100 mil i'm gonna crack in my leg which obviously i cannot do with one hand so i was meant to have a banana with this but we've actually ran out so i'm kind of annoyed about that because i normally put like a quarter three quarters of it in here and chop the rest on but i'm gonna have some ground sweet cinnamon with this which is nearly all gone so i'm gonna have to put some on the shopping list but i'll have like um protein powder or I put some of this in there, which is from Holland and Barrett's, I think. Gosh, I'm dying. Look at this little mini pancake. So freaking cute. This is the coffee that I use. It's the Nescafe Americano one. It's my favorite. I always use this one. pancakes i'm gonna add a little bit of this agave nectar which is basically like a vegan version of honey I just normally go like that over and that's about it it looks so boring without, without like any fruit or bananas basically a midday it's time for like my little midday snack so we're gonna go over to my snack corner if you watched my cleaning video you would have seen my little snack corner i picked up these in oh my god b and gulon gulon i literally just have like two of these little wafer things that's how big they are yeah not very big but they're like a nice little sweet snack they are currently in the fridge i'm just kind of thinking what to have for my lunch i know the green beans need to be in, so i've got some of those out where i've got the green beans here um, right, so I have these curry chickpeas, which I think I'm going to have with them. These are also from Aldi. cumin seeds ground turmeric and then just some ground cumin i'll just show you guys this here 
um, if you're interested or interested at all. So I've added the cumin and turmeric and I'm just going to fry it until they cook. Okay, so that's what they look like now and I'm going to add some more agave instead of honey. So this is probably the most random lunch I've ever had but both of this stuff needed to eat and I've also got half a wrap which I just cut in half. I think I'm going to, I don't know how this is going to taste but I'm going to mix them together in the wrap and then like leave some out to eat. <laughs> I'm aware it really does not look appealing but it should taste nice. Right, so it's time for taste test. Mm. That's actually really nice. For the rest of my lunch, I've just put up a little tangerine and these pea snacks. These are the sour cream and chive ones from Aldi. These ones are my favourite. Actually, to be fair, the red tight was it chilli curry ones that I used to do were my favourite, but they stopped doing them. Um, yeah, I'm just watching a little bit of El Darby whilst I finish my lunch before I get back to like doing some social media work and stuff. guys so it's now dinner time i'm gonna go downstairs and help my mum because she's actually doing dinner right now so the dinner my mum chose is a gino de campo one that's the ingredients for this um but yeah really easy to make a bit of chopping but we were making it for a lot more people so yeah hopefully it tastes nice we'll report back to you <laughs> I like it. Okay, just got the news on, but I'm just I need to eat this first for you guys. But I'm just eating my dessert. This is plain out pro yogurt. This is just frozen blueberries that I just defrost a little bit and then pour them in here. So yeah, really really nice. I always like I used to always have this and then I stopped having it. And now I love it again. Okay, so I know this isn't really food. My camera's flashing red, so I'm gonna be quite quick with this. But at the moment I have been loving vanilla chai. Tea. it's just a tesco finest one um but yeah it's so nice it's literally my favorite herbal tea at the moment i'm trying to cut down on my coffee intake so i try and have one in the morning and that is it and then the rest of the day i'll try and have other stuff so like peppermint tea i really really like as well that's another like recent thing i really the only herbal teas i ever used to drink were like green tea okay so sorry guys my camera actually died then so i just had to put on charge quickly but yeah basically i was just going to finish the video there because i'm done eating for the day so yeah, I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Also, turn on my bell notification so you're notified whenever I upload. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye!